it going, guys? It's, it's Phantom Eagle, and I'm still at my, I'm still at work. It's uh, Friday, but it's actually, but for me, it's by Monday because of my time schedule, because of my schedule. And I'm on my second 30 minute lunch break because we always take a lunch break at 1 and 5 o'clock. I don't know why, but that's just how it is. And I'm smoking on my tobacco pipe because I'm just stressed out as fucking hell. And I decided just to pass the time by smoking a pipe and making another YouTube video. Yeah. Yeah, I'm smoking on some, uh, Captain Black Gold. You can see the uh, package pretty good. This stuff is actually pretty good. I got it at the uh, tobacco shop. I also got uh, two other flavors right here. I got Captain Black Royal, which is pretty good. And I'm trying to find, oh, there it is. I also got Captain Black Original, which is also pretty good. And you wonder how I would break these. Is uh, I'd write this a uh, a uh, eight point eleven out of a ten. I'd write this a nine point two, and I'd write this a uh, nine point seven. This is my uh, little pipe right here. I had this guy for about a year. Helps me relax and reduce stress. And the reason why I decided just to film on my second lunch break is just because I decided to try out vlogging. Despite not knowing jack shit about it, really. I think it's just uh, some dude talking to the camera and just talking about shit about their life or what, or what the fuck is going on, like, uh, like, Oh, it's one Charlie, and many other great people like him. So, uh, probably asking, uh, why am I lighting so many matches for my pipe? Well, it's because I, I, uh, Put, put too much pressure on the tobacco. And it's causing me to have a uh, longer draw. Yeah. Well, 
That's why I got this little tool right here. That will this multi tool. This is the uh, plunger for pushing in the tobacco. This is the scooper for when you're done. And this little pick right here. That's what I need right now. This will uh, in case if you pounded the tobacco too hard, or if you're not getting enough ventilation, smoke it right. Just pick it in and uh, rearrange it a bit. Ah, right, now that's better. Not much of a draw anymore. Hmm. That's some good, good pipe tobacco. You know, I just wish that we could drink while we're at work. Like, uh, like I don't mean like go go all crazy and just get flat out drunk and not do your job properly. I mean, like at least one drink, like at least one drink, maybe two. Depends on uh, how much alcohol you can take before being totally fucking intoxicated and dizzy. Like, like one or two beers a, a day. Because beer is, beer is good. Or whiskey, maybe wine. Some tequila. Vodka, rum, gin. You know, just just have a little amount while you're working. Not enough to get you flat out drunk. Just enough where uh, you can still work effectively and efficiently. I've been working at this Walmart for three years. Started like um, when I was 19. Like just right after high school because I got held back in the first grade. <sighs> because I wasn't really doing that great in school at all. I wasn't even paying attention, but that's my own fault. But, whatever. It's all in the past. Do I like working nights at Walmart. Mm. It's alright. Pays the bills. I don't really like it, really. Some of my co-workers and even some of my bosses don't even like this place either. Which is uh, kind of sad, actually. I feel bad for them. I was hoping to like work here for like uh, a year or so, but apparently I end up working for three years. You know, um, there's some things that that suck about working nights, and there's some stuff that uh, is pretty pretty nice for working at nights. Like, the, the part that suck is when you, uh, you don't really hang out with your friends that much anymore. Like, I haven't seen most of my friends in a while, actually. But that's, that's life. That's, that's the life of, <laughs> that's the life of adult. Everybody's like that. Even my friends. 
what is whatevs. Another thing that kind of sucks for uh, working nights is uh, um, having trouble sleeping for like like it's summer right now, and it doesn't get dark till like nine. And I go to bed at like 12 o'clock, like I eat some lunch and then I try to go to sleep. But sometimes the uh, the sun gets, in, gets a little in my eyes despite the blinds being closed. And it's uh, hot as hell in my room despite having a fan and blowing cold air on myself. But, um, one of the uh, good parts about working here is that, um, I only work four days and I get three days off. <laughs> so I have a longer weekend than, uh, <laughs> most people. Like, while I'm on my four days, when I work from, like, 9 p.m. to 8 a.m. I get three extra days off. <laughs> but unfortunately though, the, the first few hours of my first day off, I, uh, I sleep through half of it. I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna smoke a different flavor. I'm gonna try the uh, Royal. And while I get my tobacco, I might as well teach you guys how to how to uh, smoke a pipe. So what you do is uh, get your pipe, your tobacco, and uh, this thing is uh, optional. What you do is uh, get your tobacco right here. Smells smells awesome. So uh, you get like a uh, like a little hand pinch like this right here. First first bit that goes in. You uh, you can tap you tap it in lightly, like just just nice, like that. You you don't have to use your plunger; you can use your finger, but uh, it just works a little better with the uh, plunger. You know, just put pack it in like this, like a flintlock. Your second pinch full. Put it in. Put it, push it in a little harder. And then, third pinch. Depends on the size of the uh, the bowl of your pipe tobacco. Of, of, of your pipe. You uh, push it in hard. Like a little harder. Than your second one. Second plunge. Test it to see if test the draw. Not too bad. Just needs a little adjustment. So you get this little hick right here. Get it right here. Around a bit till it's uh till it, until it's just right. Hmm. Oh, there we go. 
And now uh, you light it. I like to use matches because you get a more pure taste. You can use lighters, but uh, it can sometimes be a little more difficult. But uh, you should never use torches because that because that could damage your pipe, <laughs> cause it to crack and break, and then your pipe is now useless. I still forgot to get the uh, strike on matches. I need to stop by Ace Hardware because Walmart doesn't sell them. And then uh, use them for my pipe. Mm -hmm. You, uh, you're not, you don't, uh, inhale tobacco like a cigarette. You uh, smoke like a cigar, basically. You just suck the air into your mouth through the pipe, but don't breathe it in. Because that will get you sick. Same with a cigar. Like one of the benefits for having uh, a pipe instead of like cigarettes because that uh, cigarettes are only like 50% tobacco and 50% chemicals. Two, cigarettes smell bad, but pipe tobacco smells good. My uh, my ex girlfriends I used to have. They actually did like my, the smell of my pipe tobacco. And they also tried uh, some of my tobacco as well. And with, and also this is 100% pure tobacco, with no chemicals. Maybe like maybe nicotine. Like this one has nicotine in it, but some companies actually do make uh, pipe tobacco with no nicotine in it. Also, some of them. And it, it also tastes pretty good. And um, smoking cigarettes are not attractive, but um, smoking pipes are actually more acceptable in society. Makes you look uh, smarter, cooler, and uh, Sophisticated. Yeah. Even if you do smoke cigarettes, you could actually, like, take your broken cigarette or your uh, broken cigar and smoke it in your pipe. A lot of people used to do that back then. I actually got this guy for $50 at Paul Cigars. They both sell cigars and pipe tobacco. Mm hmm. Mmm. Smells great. Oh, it's really smelling great. You can blow it on yourself and you won't smell bad. I 
I'm joking. I'm doing that as a joke. I don't. I don't fucking do that. <laughs> well, probably a lot better than Axe body spray. This helps a lot. I feel more, a lot more relaxed. Especially since my uh, feet are killing me because I'm walking on concrete all the day. And I also got these big ass boots right here. See? Yeah. Got these fucking boots. That's it for my first vlog video. Please like and subscribe to if you want to see more Phantom Eagle content. Thank you for watching my video, and you guys uh, have a good day. See ya.